Will Lanell get the six wins or more? Customize pets, free to play, play arena. I like this. I, I can live with this squad right here. I'm not a duck guy, okay? Like, I, I, if we see ducks, I roll them. But I don't just do, like, the roll for ducks. I'll be the miffed muffins. That's fitting. But if I do get some, some ducks and some dodos and some roosters, hey. Just remember, I tried to be the savior. I tried to be the savior for the system. And they said, no, we'd rather do ducks roosters. We'd rather do duck uh, or dodo rooster all the live long day. I'm going to roll a four squad. That's beautiful. That's fine. That's amazing. Okay. Okay. We'd love to see Mosquito in our next shop. This, is, this one's going to be a loss as well. But the early rounds, I don't sweat it. It does suck to lose to someone who has more ducks than you. But that's life. Okay, so this is a little bit like this is how you do business in today's economy. We get our duck a little bit stronger. Um, we're going to buy you. You're not going to buff yourself. So that's a good thing. I really appreciate that. Thank you. We're going to put you on here. Then we're going to have a kangaroo. That's a very strong unit. We're going to sell our fish. We're going to roll a kangaroo behind a peacock up at the start here. Now we got a 3-6 dog. Something like that. This is okay. Uh-oh, he's gaming. All right, Thardis, like, honestly, nice dodo, nice duck meta. Uh, I'll see you in hell, brother. Get fucked. <laughs> Eat me. Okay, next. This would be, you would be, it'd be amazing for me. I know we're going to miss the buff on this. It'd be amazing for me if this hit the dog. That's fine. It's pretty good on the peacock here as well. We know the mosquito's not long for this world. What if you gave me like a little sell? A little buy? A little pill? That's not so bad. A little roll. You know what? I think a crab would really... It would just kind of hit the spot here. You could put it right there, for example. Yeah, this doesn't look so bad. I'm not promising 10 wins. Can I also say I'm... I'm I have nothing against this person rolling um, what appears to be a level 3 duck strategy. I have nothing but respect for TTV better since 95. Okay. Now, old me might roll a camel here. But not, it's not necessary. That doesn't do anything for helping us win, which is the only thing that matters. Um, what I would say personally is you could probably sell an otter. You could maybe buy a turtle. You could then uh, have the turtle apply melon armor, like so. Then you could buy a giraffe, just for a, just momentarily speaking. You got six, seven. Okay, hold on. I can't resist the temptation, man, to just buy two crabs and go for a level three crab nonetheless. But I refuse. Sell me. Roll me. I sleep. Okay, now that you have 8 HP, we can actually do this, this, because we'd like, you know you're going to get at least one attack for the time being. There you go. It's not great. The title says it all. Yeah, what's the title? 0% meme builds only, right? Okay, honestly, your crab's going to own me. I respect that in many ways. That being said, nice try. Still need some meat on the crab, then this thing can really take off. Um, let me, it's okay, let's get started here. Maybe like one of these feels like it could hit the spot quite nicely. Don't, don't get hard stuck on the peacock. Like the peacock can leave. It could also get buffed though. I'm just gonna be straight up with you. Like I don't dislike a turtle. I'm willing to take a loss here. 
The turtle, it, it wasn't the right time for it. Garlic on this dog is going to do better. Super soak that hoe 305. I mean, what can you say? That hasn't already been said. All right, we win these. Interesting, a rooster. How delightful. Um, I think we're coming to the point where we could probably sell this peacock, even though we just invested in it. Then you, you run something like this. Yeah, that's fine. Keep the swan. Because the swan is a winner. And in this day and age, you can only afford to roll winners on your team. You can you can put a deer up here if you have to. Ah, uh, Dodo. Ah, nah. Let's have some fun, okay? Level 3 dog will be a huge help. We could also sell our crab. It's not at the point where, like, a crab is that useful. Hold on, they're going for Tabby Cat build. What the heck? You're so freaking lucky, by the way. That's super respectable. This is, unfortunately, this is a no fun uh, zone. Sorry, you're not allowed to get a win with that. Um, Crab, you had your chance, but we're kind of like, uh, we're running out of patience for you, okay? That's more like it. Thank you, game. I really appreciate it. Give me one of those. That's a big help. I'll tell you what, give me one of those. That's a big help. And I'll tell you what, you know what, for the time being, why don't you just give me one of these? That'll be weird. Okay, this is probably a loss because it's Dodo Rooster, but it's great because we do get to test the incredible theory. Um, does a deer counter it? And I think the answer to that question is obviously no. That's my fault. We almost had fun there. That's the problem. We're going to have to minimize that fun a little bit by just buying the dog again. Skunk. I have to be honest with you. The skunk is almost a fun unit. Instead, I'm going to focus merely on things that improve our scaling. Like, for example, I think a snail would do a lot of good work here. At four, we'll think about it. We'll think about Here's what they think about you. Here's what they think about you. I think you buy a penguin, freeze your dog, freeze your penguin, freeze your chocolate. What's break, breaking kayfabe? This run could actually definitely lose. <laughs> the kinds of runs we've been rolling up against, like this is definitely still a lose. In, in fact, I think this specific one is going to be a loss. But we're almost there. Sell me. You know what? Unfreeze me. Buy me. Send me. Dragon me. Sure. Roll me. Sell me. Buy me. Sell me. Roll me. Buy me. Freeze me. Freeze me. Please. It's round 10. This at least get us to five. At least get us to five. This seems like a winnable run. Okay, now I won't be happy unless we get to 10. They're rolling Tabby Cat again. Is be best of luck to you? Best of luck to you on the Tabby Cat build. I'm rooting for you. I'm coming back to the light side ever so slightly. I don't know why I'm rolling a 9-7 deer at this point, but it, it is what it is. It's not 9-7 anymore, I suppose. Thank you. We'll buy one of those. <laughs> Sell me. Um, maybe. Oh, that's true. That's my my bad. My bad. I forgot. The deer is actually kind of fun. So, like, if we lose, it's probably because of that. So, just a simple dodo rooster, but at least the turkey died. Just a just a wafer thin dodo rooster. Whatever. Get owned, Doctor Smee. Nice dodo rooster. I applaud you as a as a fellow no fun gamer. I applaud you. Give me one of these. And believers get paid out. That's good, because we're if it if the believers didn't get paid out there, I cannot be held responsible for what happened to the rest of the stream. 
excuse me, can I just get a level one? A, a, a single level one unit, please. Uh, Homer. Okay, good, good despair for the doubters, at least. What the heck? Uh, this seems like a, a super loss. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Never mind. The math works out perfectly. Every time I doubt he goes serious mode. Look, I'm not trying to be a hater or whatever, okay? But the title of the stream did change to Zero Meme Builds Detected. And then I talked about how all we were going to do was try to, um, you know, like game the game as hard as we could. So, like, I mean, at some point, there's a little of a, almost like a what do you expect. I, we, I'm such a sick freak that like seven wins is like i'm not even getting out of bed for seven wins i am i am happy at least to see that this is not dodo rooster instead it's kangaroo rooster turkey tiger um which is like its own that's like when you're just getting out of your comfort zone and you're like i want to make people think that i'm not trying my hardest to win but i'm only gonna crank the dial down like two degrees That's like when, you know, your, your friend who's really good at chess is like, don't worry, I'll go easy on you. And then he opens with like D4 instead of E4. And you're like, really? You're going to go easy on me? You open with D4? Bro, I don't know it. I don't know it. I usually roll E4. I do the Trumpowski attack Raptor variation. So I'm making it easy on you by rolling D4. I'm only familiar with like 18 of the lines that go from this. Then they roll like, you know, G5. And you're like, okay. What? What the fuck? I would just like some tier one units. There's, it's, it's, it's been suggested that tier ones exist in this game. I don't know. I've never seen the, the proof of it myself. All right. Honestly, I'll just be real with you. This seems kind of cool. We're about to get our ass beat for sure. He did 111 damage. <laughs> All right. See, Major Sloth, that's a perfect one to lose on uh, for that one. Because now I'm having fun again. Now that I saw that, I'm like, you know what? You got me badger pilled. I've untilted myself. I lost to a superior gamer, and, and I'm happy again. I'm happy again. Okay, let's, let's run it back. You know, don't fixate on the meme builds, okay? Don't fixate on the meme builds. Fixate on the badger builds instead. Maybe one of these. Maybe roll me. Maybe one of these. Maybe no, but maybe fucking. Uh, maybe it's uh, fucking. Uh, just kidding. Okay. Cartoony. That's new. I'll be the cartoony Clementines. We win these. That's surprising. Now we get tier one animals. Duh. <laughs> it's true. Where were you when I got the dragon? Okay, this is like my ideal duck meta. You get a couple of ducks, you're happy you got an anchor unit. How would you fix horse? It's it's something I've given a lot of thought to. Um, I would fix the horse. I think you just honestly make it like 2-2. Two -two. And I think not every tier one unit has to be playable into the late game or even the mid game. I think if you just give it some stats and it could be like functionally used from turns like one to five, that would be okay. Two, two would be broken. I mean, one, one is unplayable. Make the buff permanent. Outside of battle? That's kind of interesting. Well, the thing is, people will go like, oh, it seems overpowered in the early game. Who actually, like, gives a shit? Because, like... <laughs> well, it sounds rude, but, like, the early game doesn't actually matter at all um, because of the 10 lives update. And I love the 10 lives update. I'm just saying, like, 
Okay, so you lose to some like overpowered horses in the early game. What does it matter like at all in the whole scheme of things? I think we I think we do this. That's a strong ass turtle, man. I got nothing in. You know what? When I see your face, there's not one thing that I would change because you're amazing. Just the way you 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 freaking are right here. Maybe. Sure. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sick. Honestly, like, you deserve this. Mouth viewer, take your loss. Get out of here. You gotta go. Then temporarily? I mean, I know, I know, you know, I know, you know, I know, you know, I know. And have you ever had a dream? Okay, give me one of these. Combine me. Roll me. Give me one of these. I love this. Combine me. Roll me. I love this. I don't know what we're going to do with this hedgehog. At some point, maybe we're going to get a whale, and then it'll be fun. Make sure to pill the swan. I'm, the, the, the Super Auto Pets devs said there was a, a meta-destroying, their words, not mine, a meta-destroying Thanos patch incoming. I'm very much looking forward to it. I still love playing Super Auto Pets. I'm really, like, I'm not sick of anything. Except the fucking... Yeah, sure, sure, Dodo Swan. Duck Dodo Swan. That's the only thing I'm sick of. If, if anything that they do starts to mitigate that, I'm a very happy individual. All right, I don't know what to say about this. This is a strange situation. It could work. That being said, I'm realizing now if the headshot gets lethal, we lose for sure. But that's kind of funny. I can respect that because it's kind of humorous. The elephant's not along for this world. The elephant's gone. That's a sell me. Buy me. I'm going to be honest. Freeze me. You're going to do a... I hate you. Um, you know what? Sure. I mean, at this point... <laughs> I don't, I'm like, okay. Hedgehog at the front. The badger, then, when it dies, can kill the blowfish, which will... Like, I think I could actually kill my whole squad in, like, a single go here if I wanted to. I could come close to it at the very least. You know, honestly, this is insane, but just hear me out. Like, a lot of people would probably tell you something ridiculous, like, don't uh, kill your best unit with a badger for no reason. But, like, honestly, like, I wouldn't expect you to understand the levels of meta I'm on right now that are allowing me to have that unit actually live and then wipe their entire squad. Kangaroo can work here, but it is also not a... Um, it's not a, a hedgehog or a badger, so, like, no thank you. Ah, this is the build, okay? So you roll this guy, and honestly, like, you... I'm just gonna be real with you. You exist just to get sacked here. But then we're gonna sell our swan and pill something in front of you, and you're gonna become freaking cracked. We might even pill two things. We're actually... We're gonna do a meta-defining swan pill. But this time, 
We're doing it tactically speaking. Okay, this is... We're gonna lose to this dog. But that's fine. I'm not gonna pill the badger. You, you asked for it. You wanted to see it. Guess what? Kansas is going bye-bye. Give me one of those. Pill me. Give me one of these. Sell me. Give me one of these, you scumbag. Buy me. Yummy. It don't matter. Roll me. <laughs> okay, we're not on lethal. This would be a great one to win, though. This would be a great one to win. At least we're harming that dog. That's all I could really ask for. Oh, this is this is not so bad, man. Now, I do need to add, like, a, it's not so good. We draw, but... Okay, get owned. That's unfortunate. Badgers, please. Y you need it. I wish you didn't, but you do. Ooh. You know, let me let me tell you something. I kind of like that. Let's get this badger popping. Ah, Chandler. Ah. It, it. Tia the dodo and a rooster, Jerry. What am I supposed to do? Okay, anyway, get owned. Nice dodo rooster build, you piece. Come back when you pass senior kindergarten. What's the threshold for getting banned for toxicity on Twitch? Because I feel like I'm, I'm rapidly approaching it. <laughs> okay, leopard's always fun. Don't get me wrong, but there's a little scorpion for us. Dude, we need this. Uh, this badger gets to level two. We're off to the damn races. What the heck? Well, that's pretty bad. On the other hand, it's actually kind of sick. I like how when you get hit by something like that, the hat falls onto your head like you're depressed. And then when you get a kill, you're not depressed anymore. Like it pops back out. That's so, like, it's just like real life. Don't sleep, OG me, you piece. That's beautiful, thank you so much. I would just like to see a badger. This is just a simple IMO. I feel like a badger would really hit the spot right now. What, what about a badger that gets eaten by a whale? I'm just gonna do it, I'm not even gonna ask. And then it like spits out another badger and we still got the ox there. It ruins his buffs. Yeah, but it kills this freaking crocodile dead for sure. Look at that. Then he pops out and he kills your freaking turtle, no sweat. Then this guy is like, what? And then I'm like, oh, too bad, you're owned. And then I'm like, you're dead. You didn't even stand a chance. But then, I, dude, honestly, I, we gotta sell a hedgehog. I hate to say it. The Hedgehog has been a nice part of the squad, but we need some space here. And now, because we can now consider rolling like a little tiger strat. Tiger badger. I don't know where you go. We might have to sell our whale at some point. But because we have so much to work with... <laughs> you know, just in case... <laughs> I feel like you could do you could do worse than that as a just in case. And then no matter what, you got to get skilled up here. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know what's going to happen here. What the heck? Okay, this seems absolutely horrendous. Like that seemed horrible. May God have mercy on your soul. Honestly, like, whale, get out of here. You, you're you stinky. I gotta, I gotta be careful with you, okay? Because now you're gonna do 28 damage, like, twice. And that's very spooky. So I basically need... I think I need, like, an ass unit to go here. Okay. 
I guess it doesn't have to be ass, so to speak. If it could just scale, that would be fine. Or snipe. We're looking for scaling or sniping. You're scaling. Uh, it sucks that the only way I could really make this work is to scale our tiger. But, you know, let's give this... Th Dude, I don't see how this could go wrong. This is basically just an extended three squad, Marty. And it loses to Dodo Rooster. Very cool. Very cool. Very fun. Guest 10, 9, 5, 5, 4. Very cool. We did get to six wins, nonetheless. <laughs> Slash marker me. It's another SAP video. And we'll start the predictions back up. You know what? Let's mix it up. Let's go back to beta win. Very cool. Very fun. Very cool. Go back to pay to win here. This is like the most urgent update that's ever been required. Is, is finding out a way to minimize dodo rooster spam that shows up literally every game right now i'll be the danish nuts dodo rooster so fun it's so fun dude check this out like dude you get a rooster and then like the dodo buffs it to 50 50 holy shit and then it spits out like two or three roosters it's a lot of fun i am very smart by the way the the average fun haver has uh logged on how did you upload a video during your stream? Unlike most YouTubers, I'm a gamer. What does being a gamer mean to me? It means that um, I like to play games. I like to have fun playing games. And that means that I have a small backlog of videos that I can then release as on the scheduled uploader. Um, most YouTubers, on the other hand, they don't... Look, and I don't mean to be super rude to the YouTube community. They don't think ahead. They, you know... Okay, so that was like the rudest thing I guess I could have said. But they they are like, oh, I need an episode of this sh stream or the show for tomorrow. But like instead of doing it, they just hope that it like gets done somehow. And then like the morning of, they're like, oh, I forgot to do that thing. And then they're like, sorry, it's late. I got to take the stream off today. I don't do that. I, I've got a very stable workflow going on here. I'm not the only one. But I got to, you know, for the most part, the only time things get like interrupted is like the situation that you saw this weekend on Saturday with Isaac, where I was like a little bit under the weather. That, that'll that happen from time to time. Why are you frozen? I'm stupid. You know what? Maybe we could get a, 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 a tabby cat going. We could at least think about it. But then are we really, like our whole game plan is to buff this thing? No, buff yourself. Streamer plus dad is perfect combination of organization plus you piece. Dude, honestly, like I'm, I got the, the, that side of adult life totally handled. We draw these. Like I, I do my chores like every night. It's crazy. I know that it, you're like every night, like legit every night. Do the dishes every night, cook, you know, five nights a week. Um, I, I, you know, I don't mean to brag because the week rolls over on Monday. I got, I got a two week streak going on the Peloton right now because I worked out on Sunday and on Monday. That's two weeks of workouts in the, in the bag right there. <laughs> Duly noted. I fill the humidifier every night, scoop the litter box, obviously, empty the dishwasher, reload the dishwasher. It's nice, man. It's nice to be on the ball. Anyway, hold on. What do we got, what do we got going on here? What we, okay, we're going to try to get a tabby cat to work, though I dislike the concept. Maybe it's time. Maybe it's time. Maybe we can achievement hunt a little bit. That's not a damn tabby cat, man. What am I supposed to do with this shit? Um, you need to leave. We need garlic. The only thing we need here is garlic. I'm actually mad. Freeze me for a sec. 
Yeah, I'm pissed, okay? I'm mad. I'm, you know, I'm sick. Give me one, give me some of that. Feed the cat? I would never. It's, it's bad. Why do you have to do the dishes every night? Because I'm like a fucking sick freak. I eat every day, which is, I know is crazy. Garlic's tier three? Oh, son of a... <laughs> That's a... Not my finest moment. I don't know what I'm doing. If I could just be legit with you right here. I think, like, I, I am now lost in the sauce. Yeah, I know. I know. Every day. It's a little crazy. Let's go. Thank you so much for that. I'm um, sure. Just get some paper, please. Dude, I was laughing. Malf has, has courted controversy on two separate occasions now. Malf, are you still here? I don't want to tell your stories without your permission, but I know it's okay, probably. Source dude, just trust me. I was laughing at... Uh, when you were talking about how people are too lazy to do their own dishes. And then, you know, like every time... Because trust me, I've been down this road myself. Every time you talk about being too lazy to do the dishes, the average paper plate enjoyers come out of the woodwork. And they're like, well, actually, you would be stupid to not uh, just use paper plates for every meal, forehead. Um, source, dude, just trust me. And then the other one that I, I was laughing was uh, when you said, like, why is it so hard for some people to just do their jobs? And you were talking about how, like, your building manager has been derelict in letting your apartment get full of mold. But for some reason, everybody assumed you were, like, going to McDonald's and just, like, yelling at some poor, like, minimum wage fast food worker. I was like, what the hell is... Every... You watch Mouth Stream, he's, like, so wholesome. Then people on Twitter are like, I know, well, I'm a big fan of you. I've seen you stream, you know, 20 hours a week for six years or whatever. Um, why would you go to McDonald's and tell some teenage kid to, like, you know, get fucked? And he had to be like, that's not what it is, actually. It, I, was, I was losing it, man. He does love poop for some reason. I don't really know. That's like a recent thing. What if we try you at the front? I don't really know what's up with that one. But on, I'm just being straight up as, as we banter here. What the hell is this? Dodo Rooster went wrong when keeping it real goes wrong. Um, okay, well, hold on. But the first thing I was going to say is that you actually, like, you know... Uh, as you get older, you, you kind of get an appreciation... For chores. Like, I, to be honest with you, and, and I don't know if everybody's going to agree with this. But to be honest with you, I would rather do the dishes for 22 minutes and then have them be clean than watch an episode of television. Most nights. It just, like, sometimes I'll, like, sit down to watch something and then I'll look at the kitchen and it'll be... Dirty, and I'm like, nah, I think I'd rather just handle that, quite frankly. Son of a... It, it happens at some point, okay? I'm not, you know, you might not be there yet, but I, at some point in your life, I, I bet you'll, you'll notice the change as well. But then, someone said, is there any reason not to buy paper plates? Except for the cost of them. Well, one reason I would say, like, is if you've ever tweeted about, like, NFTs being bad for the environment, then um, using a, a paper plate three times a day for all of your meals makes you a hypocrite. That would be, like, one part of it. And also, I mean, this is more like, I guess this is philosophical, but... Uh, simultaneously, I would say another thing worth noting is that at, at some point, you know what? Hold on, do this. I like this, man. At some point, it's just like... You, it's just, it feels good to be a little responsible. <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> Give me a poodle here for a second. Like, it, you know, I, I think it's a young person's fallacy to try to, um, you know, build your whole life in such a way to skirt around all responsibility, including things like, you know, doing the dishes. 
sometimes it's just better to just do the work, you know, and, you know, learn how to be okay with doing the work. Dude, we can actually get a tabby cat to level three. But that's cowardice. What we do first is get the poodle to level two so we live long enough to get... Oh, we should... Yeah, okay, I, I understand where you're going at here. Yeah, 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 we need a T-Rex in here. No! Whatever, we still... We, st we can still win, Copium. We can still lose, okay. That's a boomer take. So, like, pick your poison. What do you do? Eat off the, the damn coffee table. Or, alternatively, eat off of paper plates, which makes you someone who hates the environment. Or, secondarily, do your parents do the dishes for you? That's all I ask. Or, do you get the, the actual worst possible outcome? Is what you do is just not do the dishes for, like, four days. So your kitchen smells fucking disgusting and is, like, unusable. You end up putting, like, your, your cutting board on top of, like, you know, your bathroom sink counter to chop shit. And you're all, like, chopped up, like... And, and then you're... At the same time, instead of taking ten minutes to do the dishes every day, now you're like, oh, it's gonna take me 90 minutes to do the whole week's worth of dishes. And then your whole... Kitchen was unusable and dirty for the whole time. Why not just do them as the as the responsibility comes up? Chibli. <laughs> Hold on. Everyone's buffed. Sell I mean okay, sell the fish. I just get a new kitchen every time? All right. Okay, now this is based. I would like to see a T-Rex, please. You're a piece. 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 I don't know what to do. Roll me. Give me a... You... Roll me. Roll me. Scorp scorpion, cow, owl, turtle. Don't, don't. This is for the believers, okay? Please, for the believers. <clears throat> Look, people are getting nasty now. I said do your dishes. Somebody said not everybody works from home for five hours a day. First off, that's just rude. Secondly, you sound jealous. Thirdly, that's not my fault. Fourthly, Please send me an audited list of the things that you do with your day that leads to you buying the paper plates. I guarantee I will find you some space. Like, instead of hate watching right now, you could just be doing the dishes, watching the stream, your hands would be busy, and then you wouldn't be typing ignorant shit like that into the chat. It's a win-win-win. Your kitchen's cleaner. My mental is better. It's better for the environment. It's like, a, it's a life improvement. I'm not even upset. I'm just like, it's, that would be a positive thing. Counterpoint though, being toxic does own. I'll, I'll acknowledge that. That's definitely true. But I was, it was crazy to me, like, go, I guess it wasn't crazy to me because this is also like, we've had this happen, not, not with Rob, but like with people in the community where you'll be like, hey, you really shouldn't be using paper plates for like every meal. And then people will be like, no, actually, I've crunched the numbers. You should be using paper plates for every meal. And it's like, you made an assumption about me that I'm capable of doing the dishes, which makes you an asshole and you're punching down. And I'm like, damn, I didn't know, man. I just thought I was, like, you know, being responsible by, like, eating something and then running under the sink for five seconds. But I guess it turns out I'm actually an asshole for keeping my house clean. What was I thinking? Okay, just think for a second. We want to, at the very least, if we could get you to level three, I would be happy. You're still scaling. Let's, let's get you scaling, okay? Freeze me. Maybe we'll roll a level two scorpion just to be a sicko. Buff me, buff me. Why do I hate doing the dishes? I'm gonna hit you with the ultimate, like, hot take. Which is that I don't think... 
you're coming out next time. I don't think you do hate doing the dishes if, if your experience is like mine. I think you hate the idea of doing the dishes and you, you contextualize it in the way that's like, oh, here's what I could be doing instead of the dishes right now. I always am like, oh, uh, like, I don't want to do this. I don't want to vacuum. Then when I'm vacuuming, I'm like, this shit's okay. I'm just listening to a damn podcast. It's no big deal. Here's what they think about you. <laughs> Here's what they think about you. Okay, T-Rex is big. I, uh, tabby cats, man, please. You know what? We're in it for the long haul. Juice me. You gotta go. Freeze me. I still think you do... Maybe you do better here now. I don't know, man. This is... We don't... We're not as strong as we look, honestly. Yeah, no, like, I get it. Like, you know... If you're depressed... Like, I'm not asking you to do your dishes. I'm just asking you to stop... Being an asshole about me doing mine. <laughs> it's really with, like, it's just, you know, I've gone, I'm not saying I've ever been depressed, so I can't relate. But I've gone through funks in my life where I'm like, I don't want to clean my house. Like, it's just, you know, this shit sucks. But I don't like log on as when somebody, when I watch like Marie Kondo and then be like, actually, if you ever throw anything out, it's an attack on me. I just go like, oh, you know, I wish I was doing that right now, but instead I'm just going to watch you do it for a little bit. You know, it just feels right. You know what? Buff me. Buff me. Sell me. Buy me. Buy me. I'm starting to become a damn believer. No. Okay. No, no, no. I, I, I got... I, look, I honestly... I lost touch with myself for a second there. Then I realized it's not... Dodo Rooster. At the very... Okay, we're still gonna lose, but at least it's only Tiger Turkey Fly. The second most annoying build in the game. I'll, I'll pay out the believers happily on that one. I'm just disappointed we didn't get to a level 3 tabby. But, you know, life goes on. Holy crap, there's only 18 minutes left in the stream? Is such a thing even possible? The stream's been flying by, man. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. There's like a dude at the door. I waved to him. I got no idea who he is. But I think he's coming in. <laughs> he waved to me like he recognized me. And I'm like, I'll wave to you. I got no idea who you are. <laughs> That's fine. Play arena. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a ticket. <clears throat> Countering my toxicity by sending some love. You're an awesome streamer. Hearts. Hold on. Hold on. Looking at audit. Thanks for making another message so I could see the chat audit. You are indeed the person who said not everyone works from home for five hours a day. Hey, but then you said doing the dishes is zen and relaxing. Hold on, I'm just... I don't even know what, what some of these comments are. Honestly, I'll just be real. Like, you're too cool for me. Like, I don't... What does this comment mean? Dude's extremely back hung. Does that mean he has, like, a... You know what? Coming out of his back? Is that, is that what the kids are talking about these days? Would you like to explain what this means? See if you have a watermelon, you know what? Oh, come on. Oh, did I? Hold on. If I Did I run a bet here? I'm like, I'm lost in the sauce. We didn't run a bet. Start prediction. There you go. There you go. Three pigs in the shop. Is, honestly, like, there's a part of me that's like... Believers, I'm sorry, okay? <laughs> we just smooth, smooth glasses. 
Hold on, I gotta take a look for a second. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on out there. What the heck is that that's going on out there? Okay, we draw somehow. And then... Oh, baby. Oh, baby. I'll freeze you. I don't mind. I don't mind a little freeze. This squad is not good enough for like what we did to enable it. But a four or five pig is a little spicy. What the heck? Okay, we draw these. This is crazy, man. Maybe we won't freeze a scampi. I don't know. Have we ever done a level three shrimp? Maybe yes, maybe no, I, I don't know. Get ready to get pilled. Blowfish, scampi, I don't know, man. This is, it's just a weird run. It's kind of a good squad, though. You have done it? Okay, but like on the other hand, bop, bop, I'll do it again. Peace. Hold on, we chilling? Not really, this is a loss. Shrimp from concentrate. I think, I mean, th honestly, they were running a, a, a duck build. You might not see it. I see everything. They were definitely rolling ducks. Okay, you got to get pilled. Don't hit the pig. All right, guess what? You're never getting sold. Is that what you wanted? Probably. Congratulations. Ah, oh, son of a... <laughs> you know what? We got it. <laughs> Come on, we got it. At some point, you got to acknowledge you got it. Am I willing to lose? Yes. Okay, then do this. This this will this will get us there, man. This will get us there. This team is actual, like, complete anus tier right now. Anus tier, not tear, by the way. What do you think about trying to get a tabby cat going? Level three tabby cat? Possible? Two dogs? I'll just say it. Is this allowed? I still I still have not found a sloth. I'm I'm still waiting for it. Any sloth users in chat? Anytime I see I, I, I will say I feel bad. I don't think I've ever lost to a sloth. Look, we gotta pay out the believers, man. Like do something for the believers, okay? What do you do for the believers? Something like this. But I've never, I've never uh, lost to a sloth. I just feel bad. I also feel bad because I'm going to go to the bathroom real quick. See you in like two minutes. I'll just be right back. You can see me squirming. I'll be right back. It's legit.
Hey, sorry. What's up? Hello, we're back. What the heck? This run is, is, is garbage tier, man. What happened? Okay, honestly, don't hate the player, hate the game. You're going to sell one of these because I'm never getting rid of a scampy. Scampy is life. How are the dishes? I didn't do the dishes when I was gone, okay? That's a slanderous rumor. The real reason I took so long is because I've been sitting down to pee lately, as encouraged by uh, my wife. I got to tell you, I was resistant at first. You know, every... Uh, Every piece of sitcom media is like, you know, if you sit down to pee, you're, you know, whipped. That's the word we used to use back in the day. You're whipped. But honestly, so I resisted at first. And then I said, yeah, you know what? If you can't beat them, join them. And I started doing it. And I, I've been enjoying It's kind of like a leisurely pee. It's a nice time. And if I may say one other thing as well. Maybe sometimes I sit down to pee. It's a 30-second pee. I end up, you know, scrolling through Twitter for two minutes. How, what would she say when her father is who introduced it to me? <laughs> I don't have to stand to pee unlike you. <laughs> oh, anyway. No, her father did not introduce it to me. I, if anything, I guess my father probably introduced it to me. But yeah, like it's okay. It puts a kink in the hose if I sit. Do you you got the beans above the frank or something? Like what's happening there? How'd you get the beans above the frank? I don't know what I'm doing on this run. Like it seems like it's kinda again like anus here, but my favorite anime. We we haven't had a, that many jokes about, you know in culture, obviously I've made enough jokes. But we, we haven't had a lot of jokes about uh, there's something about Mary. Like in a B movie, everyone, mm, B movies, uh, my favorite anime, B movie, B movie. Nobody talks about um, there's something about Mary, man. And it's like, th does nobody see how messed up that is? You hear them all the time. They're going, B movie, B <laughs> movie. You know what I'm talking about. People talk about it? No, they all just try to... They, they try to cancel people for talking about there's something about Mary. People nowadays would be like, oh, you, they can't make any comedy. Couldn't even make Dodgeball, a, a, a real underdog story anymore. Be, they, people would be like, that movie's offensive to people who talk like a pirate. Does nobody see how messed up this is? I don't know what this bit is, but I, I'm, I kind of like it. I think I might go a little further down that rabbit hole. Okay, sell me? I can't believe I, I bought a squirrel. You know how in Rat Race, Kathy Bates says you should have bought a squirrel? I took her up on it, man. I took her up on it. I'll tell you what, give me one of these, and then I, I send it back. The sea was angry that day, my friends, like an old man trying to return soup at the deli counter. This seems not great. That might be a, a prodigious understatement. Yeah, we're dead. Okay, we can run one more back, though. Did you watch the topless Kathy Bates movie? Ah, uh, yeah. Duh. Also, in my day, we didn't know it as the topless Kathy Bates movie. We knew it by its canonical name, About Schmidt. Winner of uh, many Oscars, including Best Actor for Jack Nicholson. I can't believe you would besmirch Alexander Payne by describing about Schmidt as that movie where Kathy Bates goes topless. It did. It, it also won the Oscar for Best... Uh, I'll be the willing uh, dust bunnies, by the way. It won the Oscar for best topless scene. They contra they ran that for a couple of years in the mid two thousands. It was a spicy time. It was like you know what happened is they were losing so much viewership to the MTV 
um, movie awards with the big gold popcorn bucket and stuff like that. Best on-screen kiss. They said, screw that. We're the Oscars. You think you're gonna you're gonna out award us? Nah, man. Best topless scene at the Oscars. Kathy Bates, 2004, about Schmidt. <laughs> okay, we win these. To Toby Maguire did win best on-screen kiss. It's one of my favorite jokes from Tropic Thunder. It's like Kirk, the 18-time Academy Award nominee, Kirk Lazarus, and MTV Movie Awards winner, Tobey Maguire. It's a good moment. You know what? This is a perfect bunny build, man. It could actually work. Copium. Yes, copium. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. Okay, you know what? Mm, you know what? Yeah, okay, sure, I know, you know, it's not the first dog you've ever seen in your life. Act like you've been there before. You, you're right, you couldn't make Satan's Alley anymore. It was, it was a film before its time. Well, um, that's a draw. Bunny build sucks. I need... The achievement, okay. If I didn't need the achievement, I wouldn't worry about it so much, but I do need the achievement. Straight up, I'm like, chilies. She's like, yeah. There's a good, there is like, if Mr. Show ever came back again. <laughs> There is a good bit in there, you know? They couldn't make movies like this anymore. And then he shows, you know, like, some Lumiere Brothers films. Man Sneezing, for example. People, they, nowadays, they'd be like, he didn't even cover his mouth. Where's the Purell? Does nobody see how sick and twisted we've gotten? He didn't even do the vampire method. Come on. You know what I'm talking about, though. You know what I'm talking about. You you sneeze into your sleeve like Count Dracula. It is crazy. Like, when I was a, a kid, they taught us... Hold on. We only got three minutes? All right, never mind. You're not ready for that one. We'll talk about it tomorrow. <laughs> okay, that's not so bad. 2-7? Three, there we go. Now, there we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh, Papa. But they used to teach us as a kid, you got to cover your, your um, mouth when you sneeze, which is true. They told us just to cover it with our dang hands and then never said, like, the second part, which is, you know, like, go to the bathroom after and wash your hands. They were always, like, just, you know, cover your hands in your own, you know, mucus and then just, I don't know, Go play freeze tag or something. Cancel Christmas? Uh, excuse me, don't give him any ideas. These days, man. They taught us elbow? I'm just saying, when I, when I was a kid, look, information transfer was slower and I lived a little bit out in the country. So maybe in the cities, in, in the urban areas, it was a different story. But for me, at least, they taught us you sneeze into the hand. And I'm saying that's bad. That's like, they should have taught us to sneeze into the elbow. Obviously. Obviously. You know what? Salad me. That's, that's lovely. Then combine me. You could think about a little bison action. You know... I'm going to keep the dream alive. <laughs> maybe, just maybe. It's got everything the body needs. I don't, like, it grows both ways, don't get me wrong. Like, sneezing into your elbow is still going to lead to you carrying some snot around. But, like, it, it's probably better than getting all the germs all over your hands. Okay, goodbye. Hello? You say yes? 
I say no. Buy a worm, maybe, and I say go, go, go. You buy a worm. I don't think it can make it, but again, there's an achievement in it for us if it works. Maybe, maybe. Yeah, if anything, you should have like a little sneeze can on your desk or something. That would be kind of sick, right? So like when you sneeze, you just sneeze into the sneeze can. And then every day they like, you know, hit it with like some UV lights or something like that to kill all the germs. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? I mean, there's three bisons, but like, what are we supposed to do with this? I don't know. I guess buy them. I can't afford it. <laughs> yes! What, you guys don't like my, my sneeze can idea? What's the, okay, Kate showed me like an organics, like a composter. Like we have a composter, but it's just like a bin that we put organic matter into. And then it like, you know, just is there. And then we drop it into like a bigger bin a couple times a week. Kate showed me one last night. Look, you're never going to take off. And it's like it has microbes in it. It was a video that was in Korean. So I was a little fuzzy on like all the details. But it has microbes in it. It's got what plants crave or something. And like this dude dumped a kilogram of food into the organics bin and i swear to god he showed a time lapse of like 24 hours and the microbes ate the food in 24 hours he said it can eat up to one kilogram a day and then it, the residue it leaves is like just a fine like nutrient rich dirt that you can then he, he then said like he gave a bunch of the dirt to his uh friend or not his friend, his dad and then his dad used it as like soil to grow his plants and the plants turned into like jurassic park it was actually insane okay it doesn't go through bones that's the that was the one question i know people are gonna be like monkey ass no like animal bones you know the organics get animal bones so you know you still gotta throw that somewhere else but i'm just gonna be like straight up with you if you have one of those composters, I give you, you have my permission. Now, I'm a nobody, but you have my permission to just throw your animal bones in the garbage. Or even like the can recycling. It'll get to a place where they know what to do with them. It's a spicy uh, creature right there. Yeah, okay, we'll lose this one. We already, I can't believe we paid out the believers, man. This is kind of, it's kind of absurd. This run is like not that good. <laughs> wait, no, it's amazing? Yeah, wait, no, I'm wrong. It's kind of amazing. This could get to 10. If we win this round, I promise you we're going to get to 10. That's terrible news. What the heck? Time, slow release scorpion? What the heck? We win these? You need it. Unnecessary. Insubordinate and churlish. This is like, this is our pivotal moment, so why don't you hit me with something like this? Slow release scorpion is kind of a cool idea. I don't know how it would work. La last night, I literally ran four scorpions in front of like a maxed out dog with melon armor. And I was so ready to post a screenshot, man. Oh, well, that's easy enough. I was so ready to post a screenshot. Lost 10th run, 10th win. I got, to, I got to nine wins with this most annoying build of all time. Four scorpions and, and one dog, but it didn't quite get all the way to 10. Well, anyway, we'll pay out the believers. It, it was a fun stream for sure. 
Um, the fish bit for a bit, and then the game bit back. Da -dunk, 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 dunk Had a great time playing Super Auto Pets. Give me a slash marker. That slash mirror. 